back to another episode of Art Bites on this lovely station called Odd Creations. Um, today we're going to be talking about an artist named Chet Phillips, and uh, we're going to quickly take a look at his Instagram page. Here's his Instagram page, Insta Chet Art. If you really enjoy, if you want to check more about what he posts definitely check it out if you like it give them a follow um you know that'd be really that means a lot uh, okay so let's hit it let's go to his website we're going to check out his uh t public he he has his website he has an etsy shop and he has a t public um so he's done some really cool t-shirts he has these uh uh characters in cars or vehicles and so he has a gremlin probably in a gremlin which is kind of funny um he has boba fett and a fett let's see what else does he have on his uh Let's see, he has this Fallout t-shirt. Oh, it's a Fallout mask. Interesting. That's pretty cool. Um, let's see. He has This Is The Way t-shirt from, uh, from, I guess, one of his Matchbox series. All right. All right, well... That's definitely, you know, it's really cool to see that artists like to promote their art on t-shirts. You know, it's a great way for someone to, um, um, you know, have people enjoy their artwork is by having it on a t-shirt. Um, so let's go ahead and quickly go to his website and check out a little bit. So he does this amazing thing thing and he what he does is he likes to make um a series of playing cards and he has this series of uh kaiju baseball cards and so basically what he did was um what he did is uh he took different kaiju and made them into to represent uh, a card in the set of the playing cards. So that's pretty cool. Um, let's see, let's see what else he does. So those are his car playing cards and you can buy things on his website. He has a coloring book. He has um, all these artwork. Let's see what else we can find. So, so yeah, that's his website, and on his Etsy page, which is uh, etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash chat art. You know, you can buy his work there uh, on on Etsy, or you can buy it on his website. Um, both both places are good. So, the way I found out about chet phillips is i was just typed in samurai on etsy just because i always like samurai things and so i just was just curious to see what i could find so i typed in samurai and i found these um th these prints and i was just like man these are so cool and then i went to his uh so then i went to his chet chet art and then i looked at his work and i was like wow this is really cool you know, he has a whole bunch of things and, you know, like fantasy, sci-fi, pop culture. And I thought it was very cool how he does how he does it. And so I reached out to him and I said, hey, I want to feature you on an episode of Art Bites. And so that's what I'm doing is I'm featuring him on an episode of Art Bites. Um, I keep my eye out for people who definitely have talent. And also, I want to support uh, artists from anywhere in the world, if I'm able to. Uh, another great thing about Chet Phillips is he almost everything comes signed, especially his uh, 
prints they definitely come signed and some of them are even limited to 50 so keep your eye out when you look at a print make sure you see if it's limited if it's limited decide on if you want it because if you do I'd pick it up sooner than later um, so it's really amazing um, I really hope that you enjoy this episode of Art By It's definitely check out his Etsy definitely check out, uh, out his website and definitely check out his uh, Instagram and if you like his artwork give him a follow uh, you never know when an artist does a sale and this is usually the way that they're going to say hey I got a sale or if he comes out with a new design of a product you know this is also the other way is definitely on their social media um, I really hope that you enjoyed this episode of Art Bites, and until next time.